Hi everybody, uh, it is Tuesday, we're in our pledge drive, and it's time for a video. Get ready. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to try and do this quick, this may be the quickest video I ever do, and um, because uh, I'm trying to avoid a downpour here because this is Florida and it's the rainy season and it's about to rain. I've got little drops coming down here and there. I just want to talk about uh, one short thing. Um, our good friend and poet laureate of the Gospel Revolution, Jackie Barnard, posted uh, about how that God does not consider us any less than or greater than himself. And... Uh, because he can, he, we are equal with him. And Jackie says it blows him away, but at the same time, it seems so normal. And that's the beauty of the gospel. And only Jackie, whose prose can be profound, can come up with something so short and so elegant at the same time. I have considered equality, uh, this equality issue with God quite a bit. And um, for a while, for a good six years, I was raising a little boy as if he were my own, and I, I looked at him, and I was like, you know, he needs my guidance, he needs rules, he needs a routine, he needs everything, but um, I'm not greater than him, and uh, he's not less than me, and I thought about that for a little while, and I was like, well, he's equal with me, you know? In the eyes of the law, he's equal with me. He has the same constitutional rights as I do. And um, in the eyes of God, he is equal with me. He's no less than me, no greater than me. He's equal with me. That's the equality that Christ accomplished in, uh, at the cross for all of humanity. Humanity was not equal with God. We were even less than the angels, according to the scriptures. However, in that wonderful miracle of the cross, in his death and resurrection, humanity went to the grave with Christ in him spiritually and was raised to life with him spiritually, a new creation. And according to Paul, he seated us with him in heavenly places, at the right hand of the Father, and he's equal with the Father, and we are equal with the Father, and he and the Father are one, and we are in him, and we are one with him and the Father. That's spiritual equality. You are not less than or greater than anyone. You are equal in Christ with the Father. It's revolutionary, I know. Have a revolutionary day.